educational thing. They say, Penny, come on, New York has always changed. The world has always changed. You're just bitter because you're old. You're just being nostalgic. But there is a difference between nostalgia and longing. Nostalgia is a wistful, sentimental yearning. Not only for the past, but for who you were in that past. Nostalgia is passive. It's done from a safe distance. One of the ways that nostalgia functions is it protects us from the reality of who we actually grew up to be. Longing is a persistent sense of loss that attaches to ourselves, our history, our values, our desire, a desire that is not material. Nostalgia is attached to the past, but we long into the future. Longing lasts longer. There is a gentrification that happens to neighborhoods and cities, but there is also a gentrification that happens to ideas, and that is how New York City has gone from being the city that never sleeps to the city that can't wake up! New York City's in a coma! It's in a sugar coma! If they're not eating a macaroon, it's an artisanal gelato! If it's not an artisanal gelato, it's a cotton candy mojito! And if it's not a cotton candy mojito, it's probably a cupcake!
This is a change that destroys authenticity. This is a change that erases history. This is a change that creates cultural amnesia. And out there, the wounded spirit of New York cries out. And we are filled with longing. Thank you. Ooh.